Alrighty, um, this project is is uh, for my son, and um, it's a shadow box. I'll be showing you the parts for that. Okay, I found this material. I don't remember where. It probably was Walmart, but I'm not sure. It could have been anywhere. Uh, I liked it. Um, there's probably like two yards here. Um, right now I am using it to uh, line a shadow box. Um, I did not make it the full size of the shadow box, as you can see in here, in the shadow box here. I have already pinned it into place because this shadow box has padding in it. Um, this particular theme it will be on uh, Captain America. He is one of my son's favorite superheroes. I am thinking about doing more of these, but I'm not sure if I'm going to do a video of them or not. Um, anyhow, we're going to attempt to pin or sew some of these things on to here. I have, I have um, Captain America car. Okay, I think I picked this, these cars up at Flea Farm as a set. Um, I have the, the bad guy. I have, I don't really don't know who he is. That's really bad of me. <laughs> if you know who he is, don't feel, be afraid to say in the comments who, the, who his nemesis is. That's fine. Um, I mean, yeah, it's Red Skull. I'm sorry. I have Red Skull's car also, and I have the comic. Uh, I wrapped it in plastic so it would not get wrecked. I got this right here as a set at Flea Farm. Uh, my mom my mom works at Flea Farm and I happen to have stopped there. Um, this is not representing any stores or anything. It's just where I picked it up. I believe I also bought him at Flea Farm also. Um, and of course this is Captain America. Um, I got this at I believe Hobby Lobby. Um, the pin also at Hobby Lobby that was in a set of four of others. This necklace I made for my son. Um, it's just a Captain America charm. I mean, it's not totally perfect because this is the first time I've done a resin piece of jewelry. Um, first time. Um, it didn't turn out too bad, but it probably could have been better if I used better paper. Alrighty. It doesn't matter. It's all going in this box anyway. All right. So I'm just going to put the stuff in. I just stuck this pin in here because it's a pin. Um, I have an idea where I want these guys. Um, I kind of put them in there beforehand, so I pretty much know where I'm going to put them. I'm going to attempt to sew Captain America down. I don't know if I should lift the material or just try to attempt to sew them in here, but I think I'm going to lift it, so. And maybe we'll take the whole thing out. We about know where we want them, so. And yes, it's just pinned in here, so. We will try to keep them as straight as possible. And I'm just using some thread I have laying around. Um, so let's hope that I get it right. <laughs> Don't put them in cricket. Alrighty. So what I'm going to do is just try to sew him into spot so he doesn't roam in the box here when I get it all tacked back down again. Um, uh, 
if it looks hard, it is. Okay, um, I'm going to tap down his boots here first. There. Sorry. Yeah, my, my son, um, he's, um, we met Captain America in Florida at, uh, when we went to, um, Universal, and we thought it was pretty cool. Even though we went, we wanted, we were hoping to see Iron Man, which we didn't, but that that's all right too. I mean, we still enjoyed it. We were only we were only able to go there one day because we were, it was uh, for Make a Wish, so. We had a good time. Hoping to get back down there eventually. Doesn't mean we will, but hopefully we can get this to lay a little flatter in here. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna put one more string around him just to keep him from moving around when we put this on the wall. Yeah, this is going to be hung on the wall, so. And there we go. I'll just sew it off here. Put a knot in here. Another knot in there for extra measure. There. And hopefully he'll stay here. I gotta go find my scissors now. Buried it. Buried. And tie another knot in the bottom because we wanna wanna try to get the cars in here next. I had this layout already planned out so ahead of time. I got, a, I got a cat here playing, and she just grabbed the string. Little monster. Yes, I call most of my pets monsters. Let's try to get that string out of view here. Okay, I've never actually done one of these before, so... And I want that up there. So we're going to attempt to put this car in here. Um, the only thing I could think about of doing for the cars was going around the wheels of the car. I don't want to destroy it in case later on he decides he wants to take them out. So he can just trim it out later. Or what, a, what a have you. So what I've decided to do was just come up and get behind the, get around the wheel of, of the car itself. So I'm hoping, oops, I'm going to put a little thicker knot in there. That might help. Or I can always loop it on the bottom there. Maybe we'll loop it. All right. Alright, alright, try again. I don't want it too close to the top neither because I want it to be able to be seen. Okay, what I'm going to do is. Yeah, I'm going to go do that that way. Woohoo! Both threads are on there. If I can get it tucked in there. Well.
<laughs> Ooh. Um, I'm going to try to grab this loop here. Yeah, there we go. There. All right. We got one wheel on there. <laughs> one wheel. Yay. Um, so I'm going to do the next one too. Come up by the wheel here. You have to wait. Yes, I talk to objects that are not alive or real. It's just me. Ouch. Okay, let's get it around the other wheel. Come on, come on. Cooperation here. Boy, well, the other one worked out really nice, and this one is kind of stubborn. There we go, got it! Yay! All right, um, I'm probably gonna do the front wheels too, just so it doesn't run away. So we'll come up over here, and the wheel well there. And try to get it looped around on the other side there. Ooh. Ooh. Oh boy. Cooperation car. Okay, one more wheel to get, and then we'll have her into spot, I hope. <laughs> Tighten her down. Ouch. I hope you guys can see this. Okay, what I'm attempting to do is put the the um, thread around the wheel wells. I tried going through the wheels, but um, there's no space in there for a needle. So I all I can do, all I thought I could think of, was to do the wheel wells themselves. again okay so that's all I could think of to do was to was how to do it Then we have it on there. Alrighty. Now to cinch this one down. Oop, a little high there. Alrighty. Thank God no one's going to see the back, <laughs> other than us. <laughs> okay, then I thought about putting this car like that. And I have enough thread, I think, to do this car as well. I thought this was kind of a cool idea. So then once I get these cars down then I'll pin it I'll pin it back down and 
All right, here. Come up over here by the Hulk here. All right. Okay. And again, I tried to put the needle through the wheel wells and I could not succeed with that. So what I thought about doing was just going around the wheels again. If I can get it to stay in spot while I'm trying to get the other, <laughs> the other side in here. I hope you can see me working on this. <laughs> uh, uh, I told somebody I was going to do this online, so. So, what I'm going to do is get this string in there. Got it. <laughs> cool. It'll look better once I get the needles in spots, so. Almost there. One more, and we're hopefully, hopefully got it all tacked down. Good one. There. Okay. All right, now we're gonna flip it over and tie it off. And we have gotten the cars on. Come on. I'm not good at making knots sometimes, so. I'm sure you all can relate. All right. Now, what I want to do is close it and see if the cars are where I want them, and they are. And we'll get all the wrinkles out as best as we can. Alright, so I'll just pin this one down, and all I did was pin it into the thing. And then put these the opposite direction there. Okay, and this one over here. There. No, well, it stays, so we're good. <laughs> and this one, I'm going to just, it's a pin, so if you can see that, I don't know. Okay, it's a pin, so we're just going to stick it right next to Captain America there. Um, this is a sticker because it's a it's from for scrapbooking but I thought it would look really cool in here. 
And I couldn't find Captain America by itself, so that's... And then I'm putting that right there. Um, I'm going to pin this into place. I have to go get some pins. I had some pins laying out for it. But most likely I put them away. So we'll have to... I have some blue ones, so... And that's the reason why I wrapped it in plastic, so I couldn't destroy the plastic on it. I mean, the itself. I didn't want to destroy the comic. I wanted to keep the comic intact as best as I could. So that's what I came up with for that. And then this necklace... I was going to put in here. Uh, I'm thinking about. I don't know, maybe I should tuck the necklace behind the. Hmm. This is the only one I didn't have planned out as to what to do with it. Um, Cause this was a last minute um, thing. So I'm just thinking about picking up the thread and just sticking it in there like that and just leaving the rest of the chain hang down. Oh, I didn't catch it all. Hang on here a second. Maybe that's what we'll do with it. Just catch the loops here and let the hang a chain hang down. And just stick it in there like that. There. No, I think that's what I'm gonna do with it. Just leave the chain in there, leave it hang down. Alright. So that's, this is going to be up on my son's wall. Um, I thought it looked pretty neat. Let you all see the whole thing. It's gorgeous. I think, I think it looked good, so. And you can see the pin up there. I know you can't, but if it's on the wall, people walking past will be able to see it, so. It looked pretty neat, and it turned out pretty good. Um, I might... I'm going to pin down the rest of the comic, I think. Let's see if I can find some more blue headed pins here. Yep. And yes, I have a special guest again. My cat has come to visit. Um, she is avoiding the living room <laughs> because we have a new puppy and she has been avoiding the new dog. Instead, loves to pester me. <laughs> Alrighty. Okay, so now this is what it's going to going to look like in its full glory. I think you'll like it. All right. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, if you like these, please give me a thumbs up. Um, I will probably be doing more crafty projects on Friday. This is going to be released on Friday. Um, so please subscribe. Uh, so please subscribe, like, and comment. I'd love to hear from you. Um, always love to hear from people. I hope you enjoyed watching this tutorial on this. Um, Oh, and uh, the material, I just, I used a sewing machine on the material, just so y'all know. I know I forgot to say that, but I, um, I sewed around the edges so the edges weren't all loose and stuff, so, so it looked, it looks a little nicer. I mean, my sewing isn't the best. I know I've really got to work on doing the sewing machine. I'm really crappy at it. Um, some things turn out pretty good and other things, well... <laughs> Anyhow, um, I hope you enjoyed watching this video, um, and I will be doing uh, another one of these as soon as I get the parts. I am 
in the process of looking for a few other superhero characters. Um, I will be probably doing some of these on also on uh, some of the if I can get my hands on other people like Barbie, the, um, just to name a few, uh, some girly stuff also. So I'll see what I can do and thanks for watching. Um, hope to see you again sometime. Bye bye.